The world is a huge place. It can be hard to imagine what it can be like beyond Earth. Though planets, galaxies, and even the possibility of universes can stretch further and have new fascinating aspects to discover. So today, here at Unexplained Mysteries, we will be taking a look at three space discoveries. Scientists believe there could be an anti-universe next to ours. The idea of there being multiple universes has long been a key idea in numerous branches of theoretical physics to explain some of the mysteries of quantum mechanics. It had gone through phases in its life, as all ideas do when they develop and evolve. First proposed by Hugh Everett III in 1957, he named it the Relative State Formulation, or the Everett Interpretation, basically stating that there are an infinite number of universes to account for every combination of possibility within not just our own universe, but all of the other universes too. It was not until the 1970s when it donned the name the many words theory and became much more popular. Today, the concept has formed the basis of science fiction tropes, become a fun plotline or even coined terms completely unrelated to quantum mechanics. For example, think about how casually we talk about the multiverse or how this is often an explanation for the Mandela effect or even the naming of the Marvel Cinematic Universe. While to most of us non-physicists out there, this concept is fun to think about, we often dismiss it as a genuine possibility quite quickly. Each explanation of quantum mechanics has been deemed as valid as one another, and the many worlds interpretation remains prevalent in the field today. Not only that, but scientists have a new breakthrough that could push us one step closer to understanding the impact the many worlds interpretation could be having upon not just our universe, but a possible other too. This somewhat new suggestion is a little different than the many worlds theory, suggesting instead not infinite universes detailing every one of life's possibilities, but instead an antiverse where time runs differently than how we know it to. Scientists have been investigating the symmetrical nature of the universe, and it has led to questions about just how far these patterns can stretch, with some presenting the idea of an anti-universe right beside us that is essentially a mirror image of our own. One of the most distinct traits is that time could allegedly run backwards in this theoretical universe, in reverse than what we know. Another existing concept in physics is the idea that there are some fundamental symmetries in the universe. There are three factors understood to be symmetrical throughout the universe, and they are charge, parity, and time. This theory is referred to as CPT symmetry. The general notion is that a physical system that exists and is made up of particles will follow the same laws as an identical system made up of antiparticles like a mirror image of one another. Not only are the physical properties flipped, other aspects, namely time, are too, meaning the antiparticles will also move backwards in time. All physical interactions in the universe tend to have these symmetries. Further heightening this excitement is that as of 2022, physicists are yet to find an instance where all three laws of nature, charge, parity and time are being broken at once. New theorization seems to suggest that this rule could apply not only to the interactions that take place within our universe, but also to the universe as a whole, meaning there could be a second universe symmetrical to our own. A paper accepted for publication in the journal Annals of Physics in March 2022 saw researchers suggest that the hot, dense formation of the early universe gave us a great deal of uniformity. This regularity has been credited to making time look symmetrical as it goes both forwards and backwards. If we accept that this symmetry is present completely throughout the universe, then when do we draw the line? Who or what is to say that the possibility of this anti-universe is not plausible? This would be a significant breakthrough in theoretical physics, possibly explaining dark matter. We currently have three neutrinos, a type of subatomic particle. These neutrino types are the electron, neutrino, muon neutrino, and the tau neutrino, all of which are left spinning. If we were to have an anti-universe alongside our own, the symmetrical nature would make these neutrinos right spinning, something that is necessary 
for our understanding of dark matter, but that we have not yet discovered, at least within our own universe. If we did have evidence of right-spinning neutrinos in our universe, this could account for the dark matter that has gone undiscovered thus far, filling in a huge gap in our knowledge. In reality, this is not something that we are able to definitively test, though testable theories can help to point us into the right direction. For example, researchers have hypothesized that if we were ever able to detect these new elusive neutrinos, one of these three new right-spinning particles should have no mass. Therefore, if scientists can measure the mass of subatomic particles and find them to be massless, then this could point in the direction of the anti-universe theory. Similar conclusions can be drawn if researchers were to stumble across a lack of gravitational waves. This theory is exciting, incredibly so for researchers in advancing our understanding of the world we are living in, but also for the public to see such a drastic shift in our understanding of not just one universe, but two. Green pea galaxies may have reheated the universe The Big Bang is the leading and most widely accepted theory as to how the universe was formed. As we understand it, we experienced a Big Bang, an explosion of sorts, in which the universe was in an incredibly hot and dense state. This was then followed by a period in which the universe cooled down for an approximate billion years. After this cooling period, there was a mysterious reheating that took place. We call this the cosmic reionization. We do not know why or how this reheating occurred, except that in 2016, an international team of scientific researchers believe they may have cracked the code, finding the hidden catalyst that kick-started this heating process. There are galaxies, dubbed green pea galaxies, thanks to how they look on the slogan Digital Sky Survey, or SDSS, which are believed to have played a key part in the cosmic reionization. These green pea galaxies are responsible for putting new stars and new galaxies into the universe in a manner not too dissimilar than the Big Bang itself. This introduced a lot of new energy into the early cosmos, possibly having had a monumental impact. Despite how long ago this took place, the dwarf galaxies created from this lay undiscovered until 2007. They were only noticed by mistake as volunteers began to study deep space photos and gradually spotted their presence. The 2016 hypothesis that these green peak galaxies were behind the cosmic reionization was a consequence of a study from the SDSS which examined 5,000 green peak galaxies. From these 5,000, just five were selected to be examined and analyzed in more depth via the Hubble Space Telescope, one of which, given the snappy name J0925-1403, was emitting photons that had the capability to ionize hydrogen. Until this particular green pea galaxy was observed, any galaxies that had been leaking photons were at a rate so slow that they were easily absorbed by the surrounding gas and dust. J0925-1403, however, was ejecting photons at such a high volume and rate that the impact was far more significant. The explanation of hydrogen ionization is in keeping with the current assumptions and facts we have surrounding this reheating. Already the electrons and protons splitting apart despite being previously joined within hydrogen atoms. This would provide a new burst of energy, like what we assume would be needed. The link between cosmic reionization and these green pea galaxies is useful as it tells us where we need to be looking to find out further information. It gives us a starting point to search further into the area. It is hoped that the James Webb Space Telescope would provide some further information once it is fully configured. NASA Orbiter Spots Chinese Rover and Tracks on Mars Sometimes we get a chance to look at our creations from afar and look at what a great invention we have made. One opportunity for this arose recently, as on March 11, 2022, one of NASA's spacecrafts caught a glimpse of China's Zhurong rover on Mars. The Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter is fitted with HiRISE, the high-resolution Imagine Science experiment camera, which captured the image of the Zhurong rover. 
The image even managed to show around 1.5 kilometers of tracks that the rover had made since landing in May 2021, showing the southward direction of its journey. Zhurong is one aspect of China's Tianwen-1 mission, looking to explore Mars. This includes an Orbiter 2 and seeks to survey the surface features of the Red Planet. Initially, the rover was meant to stay for just 90 days, but this time has been exceeded as it continues to explore the geology present on Mars. The image is incredibly clear, given the 288 kilometers away MRO is from Zhurong which is just 3 meters in size. But what do you make of these outer space discoveries? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comments section below and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.